Hi, I'm Ramey, and I'm going to be talking about the five kinds of knowledge. And in order to do so, I'm going to be trying to teach my husband how to do the dishes. And I also want to see what he already knows about doing the dishes. So, here he is. Hello. <laughs> He's a really good sport. Uh, he just finished biking 90 miles and then running three. So now I told him he has to learn how to do the dishes. So yay, Bodhi. All right, Bode. So if you were to do the dishes, um, first of all, we're going to talk about the declarative knowledge of form. So what do you need to wash the dishes? What, what will you be using and how will those things work together to help you accomplish your goal? Well, we need some water, some soap, and obviously something to wash. So it either be this pan or you know, any one of these bowls or plates. Okay, what else would you use? Um, I'd also use this nice scrubber sponge thing that I have here. Okay, and how would those things work together? Well, basically what I do is I put the water in the pan, and then, um, well, before I do that, I put some soap in the pan. So you don't have to do it yet. You can just okay. tell me, because you're declaring your knowledge. Yes, of course. <laughs> so I put the soap in the pan, and I put the water in the pan, and then I just use this brush to scrub out the pan, and then I wash the excess, excess soap out of the pan and put the pan away. Okay, so for declarative knowledge of substance, what would be different about this pot and those pots over there compared to the rest of the dishes? Well, I'm not really sure. Well, would you put the would you put the pots in the dishwasher? I wouldn't. Because, Why not? Well, the pans have a special uh, cooking um, adhesive or coating on them, and so we don't want to put those in the dishwasher because that'll eventually um, wear out the cooking surface of the pan. Okay, thank you. Now we're going to talk about procedural knowledge of form. So now I want to see if you can actually use these things to actually wash the dishes. Could you show me some of your techniques for scrubbing this pan or this pot? Sure, and you'll have to tell me if I'm doing this right. I will. This is one of the first times I've ever done dishes. No, not really, but... We've already placed the soap into the pan, and I get enough water in there to where it doesn't... Um, wash out just like that so I get soap everywhere. Now would you be able to use like a really rough sponge on this? Nope, I'm using the softer side of this sponge because you don't want to use anything rough on these pans because they're one of the one of the nicer wedding gifts that we got and <laughs> gotta and make them last a while. And how do you know how much soap to put in with the water? Well, I guess I don't really know the appropriate amount. However, um, I just try to get enough soap so I can get the whole surface, surface of the pan coated. And then what I do is turn the water back on. Nobody likes to waste water, right? And just scroll this around, rinse it out. Okay, while you're doing that, let's talk about the procedural knowledge of substance. So where do you find the things in order to wash the dishes? Well, usually the soap is by, on, by the sink here, or underneath the sink. The water is, of course, just available to, um, you know, 
anybody that wants to turn on the faucet. In this part of the world. Yes, in this part of the world. We're one of the lucky few in this part of the world. Um, <laughs> in the world, we're lucky in the world to have water. But, um, and then, um, you know, obviously the dishes are sitting here, so we've got that. And Some the of them scrubber, are sitting there. Some of them always, are sitting out there. Okay. The scrubber is always sitting here as well. So. so what would you do if one of these things were gone? Or you were well, at someone else's house and you didn't, couldn't find them? I'd just probably just start looking for it. And then if I couldn't find it, ask, I would either ask you or if you weren't around, I'd call my mom. <laughs> so... Okay, and then if they were gone for good, where would you go to buy more if have, you were out? Have to go to Freddy's. That's where you okay. can find anything. Okay. Um, all right. Now, for purpose and context, um, why would you want to do the dishes? Well, it's nice to enjoy a clean house, and um, I know that <clears throat> my wife is happy when the dishes are done and so that's always really important if you're married you know what I'm talking about and yeah it's just a presentable place if people come over then you know things aren't messy and you'd be able to use the dishes again right yes it's nice to be able to eat on clean dishes or off of clean dishes from clean dishes and then the kitchen doesn't smell as much when we do the dishes. Yeah, exactly. All right. Well, thank you for going through the five kinds of knowledge with us and dishwashing. Of course. Yeah, right? anytime. All right.